Are you using Hey! Steam? What's up, you guys? Llama Dama here with my brother. Hey, Mo. <sighs> no. Okay, just no. And today we're going to be playing Subaria 2. So, I'm going to start a new game because I have gotten halfway through this before. So, what's this game about, anyways? Watch the beginning of the video and you'll find out. Have you heard anything about Kate Walker? No, sir. Nothing yet. She should have been back in New York several weeks ago. I'm afraid she's too far gone. We're losing her. She ain't gonna be coming back. Call her! Siberia is an island. An island lost in the ocean. People say Siberia doesn't exist, but people are so wrong. The isle is covered in the tallest grass. Strange grass that grows through the snow. I must eat it all the time. They're always hungry. Hans, you must rest now. You have a very high fever. Take me to Siberia, Kate Walker. Mammoth, Siberia, all that. It's just a dream, a kid's dream. Promise me, Kate. There's no point in Mr. Sir. Try again, damn it, try again! Hello? Miss Walker? Just a moment, please. Uh, give me that. Kate? Come on now, Pen, answer me. I understand your last mission was a hassle for you. But you know, the company has ways of showing its gratitude. Kate, it's time for you to come home now. Your place is here, in New York. Your job is here. Your friends are here. Your life. Kate? Kate? Kate Walker! I promise, Hans Barber. We're going to Siberia. You choking on some dick? Yes. Excuse me. Nope, I can't. Yeah, thank you. Oh, well, shit, monkeys. There, stop. That's just no. Okay. <laughs> you need to clean your area up a little bit. My area is as clean as it can be. Hans's cylinder machine. Something, Something else he's slapped, slapped together, together since, since we, we came, came on board. board. I thought he had a very high fever. Why the fuck is he building shit? Hi! Hello there, Kate Walker. Hans, where are we? Somewhere on the way to Siberia. Is it still far? Pretty much. Nobody's ever seen this island. No explorers ever talked about it. And well, it's not on any map, Hans. I know Siberia exists, Kate Walker. Can you just call her Kate? You know what? I'm so happy to be here. To follow you in pursuit of your dreams. My dreams are now your dreams, Kate Walker. Sounds like freaking Yoda. When are we leaving again? I want to leave as quickly as possible, but it's Oscar who decides. He's the master of the train. Do you think that the train can go much further? There's more and more snow and the cold is Biting. I designed and built it, Kate. You did remember to wind it. No, not yet. Then get it wound and let's be off. I don't mean to get personal, but don't you think that this journey is going to be a bit tough for a man your age? I am going to Siberia, Kate Walker. End of discussion. You do understand. So, how do we wind the train here? There's a train winder at the head of the platform. Ask Oscar. He'll show you. See you later, Hans. Yes, see you later. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Did he shit on the floor right there? 
What? It looks like he shit on the floor. Like, let me go over here. Like, you it see that? It looks more like puke. I'm pretty sure that shit, it's brown bear. Oh, <laughs> you nasty old fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hello? Kate Walker? This is Oscar calling. Keep your driver. Oscar? Oscar. You're, You're using, using a, a telephone? telephone? Mr. Boromir has in effect generated me something very approximative, inspired by your own miniature device. Mr. Boromir is such a repository of knowledge. I am calling to inform you that we have arrived at the station, Kate Walker. Great. Which, Which station is that? The station is located in the town of Romansburg, Kate Walker. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm going to go snoop around. around. Do be careful, Kate Walker. Always am, Oscar. Oscar. Stupid ass bitch. If you're not gonna like fucking play this game, then you can just go. I can't technically play the game, Dalma. Well, All I can do is comment in the background. <laughs> <laughs> There's no need for that. Uh, oh, I'm just doing my natural element, man. I'm gonna act like a totally different person. I'm not saying act like a totally different person. I'm just saying you're messing up my bed sheets with your nasty gas. <laughs> when you can edit this out. <laughs> no, actually, I can't. Welcome to Romansburg, the last town before the vast wild glacial wastes of the tundra. Retired Colonel Emilioff Gupachev, guardian of the Imperial Marches, and the general store manager at your service, miss. How may I? Welcome, Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the frontier town of Romansburg. Gateway to the tundra. The last town before the vast plains of the frozen waste. Hmm, what a welcome. Yeah, and then there's just like people who are poor as fuck. Huh, it's us. <laughs> there's a little girl down there. Strange town. What, what do you, you make of it, Oscar? Trains should never have to stop. I simply don't like stations, Kate Walker. Nor the towns around them. That's a little bit of a generalization. The whole town is lugubrious. And I don't like these houses underneath the rails. To me, they spell T-R-O-U-B-L-E. We have to be very careful. Uh huh, still the same old scary cat. I cannot change my design, Kate Walker. Sometimes I say to myself I should just go back to New York. Do you miss it, Kate Walker? I don't know. I don't think you will ever return home, Kate Walker. It is too late now. Oscar, how come you're programmed for psychology all of a sudden? Hans isn't looking so great, don't you think? While his passion is strong, his wheel work is worn, Kate Walker. Yeah, Kate Walker. I guess so. Sometimes I say to myself that it's all just a figment of my imagination. That Siberia is just a pie in the sky. You ask yourself the strangest questions, Kate Walker. I am particularly piqued that you question my reality for an instant. Even more so that you question that of Mr. Farrellberg. I'm sorry, Oscar. That was done with me. Do you think that we're any near to our goal, Oscar? It is getting colder, that much is certain. Personally, I have no particular goal, Kate Walker. But the train and myself have not been designed to function forever. I would be grateful if you could talk about this matter with Mr. Farnberg, and him alone, if you please. I guess my brother's not playing with us anymore. He just went over to the other side of the room. See you later. See you, Kate Walker. We're gonna start streaming here in a little bit. I gotta keep up with my, uh... I just don't have any I 
Hi there, Oscar. Oscar. Good day to you, Kate Walker. Oscar, is, is your train in a fit state to carry on with the journey? What are you suggesting, Kate Walker? I take the greatest care of it. Yes, I know, Oscar. But I was just thinking that with this rude climate... It is designed to resist just such conditions, Kate Walker. You simply have to wind it up. And you weren't thinking by any chance of taking charge of that yourself? My wheelwork is complex and fragile. It is poorly adjusted for the rigors of winter, Kate Walker. Now there's a surprise. See you later. See you, Kate Walker. Hi there, Oscar. Good day to you, Kate Walker. That's it, Oscar. I've wound the train up. Now we can leave. That's impossible, Kate Walker. Why, Oscar? Soon we shall be confronting extremely cold temperatures, Kate Walker. We shall need coal to keep ourselves warm. <sighs> this time you're not wrong, Oscar. It is a bit nippy. As soon as you have filled the coal car, we can set out again, Kate Walker. I'll see what I can do. See you later. See you, Kate Walker. with this machine. Oh my gosh. Let's see what's going on inside of this shop. Good day to you, sir. My name is Kate Walker. I... Oh, you're American, aren't you? An American in a hole like this. Don't see that every day. Well, I am Colonel Emilioff. I am, in my capacity, in charge of the administration of this jurisdiction. Colonel, my train needs coal to continue my journey. Do you know where I can find some? There's a dispenser outside. Feel free to fill her up, Miss Walker. Courtesy of the state. And how do I operate this uh, machinery? Just pull the handle and the coal drops down all by itself. Automatic, see? Totally automatic. That coal machine doesn't seem to want to work. Ah... Uh, in that case, you're going to have to wait. Wait? How long? Oh, a week. Maybe two. Maintenance doesn't come calling too often. Right. I'll leave you to get on with your business, Colonel. Not much left to get on with. Machines. Oh, candy machines. Um, sir, I need to get over by uh, by there. Colonel. Sorry, I am very busy, madam. Right. I'll leave you to get on with your business, Colonel. No. Not much left to get on. He just said that he's very busy. Excuse me. Bitch. <laughs> I want to go up. Am I going to find out? Mm. See if we can't go down here.
Nothing, Nothing I, can I can do. do. It's, it's locked. What's this lever do? Absolutely nothing. I don't know why I did that. What? It's quicker. Well, I mean, if you want to come out of the closet, Bear. No. I'm going to grab that key that's probably stealing, but you know what? I really don't care. Um. I completely forgot how to uh, open inventory. Nothing I can do. It's locked. Um, which ones did I get? I'll need some change. I just gave you change. Um, do I not get the coin? Oh, I already got the coin back. I was getting very concerned. I gotta find the one that works. None of these are working and it is angering me. or I could that one doesn't even work I apologize for taking so long on this, but I know I'm supposed to get both. There we go. Take that and I'll get my coin back. All right, that's all I need, thanks.
My name's Kate, Kate Walker. Walker. Hi, my, my name, name is Malka. Malka. I'm, I'm Kate, Kate Walker. Walker. And, and you? Uh, you are Malka who? Malka. Just Malka. Why is there a gate that stops us going any lower? It's not a gate that stops you going down. It stops people going up. Hmm. I see. The old colonel says that people down here are all low life. I'm going. I'll go see what I can do. Come back and see me. I like you, Kate. Oh, uh, wait, 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 no. Yeah, actually, I do need to do that. Colonel Emilioff. Ah, Miss Walker. Tell me, Colonel, why is there a gate blocking off the staircase leading to the lower part of the town? Low down is low down, and high up is high up. People who are low down got different points of view from those who are high up. Different cattle, different fish. If you get my meaning, Miss Walker. Colonel, would you have the key to the gate? Ah, uh, no. Not anymore. Must have lost it earlier, when I was wasting my time on that damn music machine. Who can say? Hey, it isn't my fault. You being here has upset my usual timetable and general routine. If you hadn't been here, I wouldn't have gone out, and then I wouldn't have lost the key. Right. I'll, I'll leave you to get, get on with your business, business, Colonel. Not much left to get on with. That's gonna get annoying. Ah, yeah, she is. I guess I have to talk to him some more. Colonel Emilio. Ah, Miss Walker. Mm, how do I get down there then? Oh, not the most advisable of moves. All the undesirables on the plateau wash up in our little town sometime. And I'd rather any lowlife stay down low. I don't think I understand, Colonel. I'm just a soldier, Miss Walker, carrying out the soldier's orders. So, you haven't got the key then? Sorry to say. If I had it, I'd give it to you. A gate's made for opening, after all. And, of course, there's no double. Ah, got to wait for maintenance to make their call, Miss Walker. In a week or two. Colonel, you, you can't, can't repair it, can you? I really need coal, you know? No, sorry. All that mechanical gubbins, motors, engines, not my thing. That's a maintenance job for the maintenance man. Right, I'll leave you to get on with your business, Colonel. Not much left to get on with. <sighs> His voice, I like, I like his accent, but he keeps repeating that last line and I get so 
repetitive. Ah, there she is. She got the balloon now. <clears throat> Hi there. Oh, so you're still here then. Do you know who's got the key to the gate? If you give me a present, I'll tell you, Cape Walker. I'd love to, but you're down there and I'm up here. Jump down. Well, you'll just have to find a present that comes from up there. Gate. Malka, I think I've found what you're looking for. Throw it down, Cape Walker. Catch! You've, You've only, only got, got one chance! My luck, I would drop, like, I would, the key would just float away. That or the key would hold the balloon down. <laughs> Kate Walker is in trouble. We've got to go look for her. Find someone. I don't know who. Someone spunky. Yes, sir. We've got Nick Camden, a detective. He's already worked on some tricky problems. He was good. Yeah. He might just be the tick. Take care of it right now, John. Get him out there. Right, sir. Hell, what is going through that kid's head? Yeah. Hello, Camden? We've got a job for you. Uh, how shall I put it? A special job. And with that, I think I'm going to leave this here. So we made it to the bottom of the gate, and this game can be super confusing, especially since I haven't played the first one. And I might go back and find that and play it later on. But right now we're just going to play this one. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, my llamas.